Alright, I'm trying uh, Whirlpool one more time. I'm going to bump the gain all the way up to 10. I'm at 15 seconds. Run the hiss ground down to 50. I'm going to capture three dark frames at that setting. And then I'm going to try stacking. Uh, you can see it definitely got no, I mean, you got uh, hot pixels going here. That's okay. I'll, the dark frame will put, take that out. Uh, one frame. I just cut it down to just three frames just due to time for testing. I usually probably run about five to ten um, dark frames. But I found it really pays to do the dark frames at the settings that you're using. Alright, got my three. Enable it. This should turn black at the next update. There we go. Let's get the dark frame applied. I've uncovered it and I can see faintly a couple of stars. I know from my prior testing um, I'm going to do, it won't help, I don't think I've got enough stars to align. Well, I might kind of align. It's, it's going to show up pretty good. I'm going to try a line because I've got more stars showing up now. Before when I didn't have enough stars, I, it, it wasn't a line, and I could, I could do it. Okay, so let me just enable that and get it started. All right, I got deep sky stacking with alignment, and I just enabled it. So I'm getting my first input. We'll see if it's got enough stars to give me an okay on the status. Okay, got my first input. Just checking. When I did this before without the gain that I'm at, it, you couldn't, it couldn't see enough stars on the first image to know that it could align. So I had to uncheck alignment, then I could still stack. Uh, I'm on equatorial mount, so alignment's not quite as important on this. When I try uh, alt azimuth mount like I did the other day, later, um, the, of course, the align and stack is, is very important to have the align. But anyhow, I've got the align running. Okay, this is really pulling it out now. You can see it's beginning to appear. Let me get a snap midway. All right. All right. Oh, this is pulling it out nicely for stacking purposes. Yeah, I couldn't see the uh, the whirlpool at the lower gain, but the stacking is definitely pulling out the image. I'm up to five. See what we get for 10 here. Take a couple of those more snaps along the way. Well, I don't want to exit. <laughs> there we go. I'm alive. Let's see what I'm up to here. Seven. I'm going all the way up to ten, but it's really pulling out the detail. I'm getting, I'm getting some background noise, but I just went up. I uh, just ran my gain all the way up to ten. I could probably, I could fine tune that by having the histogram not quite so strong. But this shows how impressive the stacking is. All right, one more. Get the output of 10. And the air conditioner next door is making lots of noise. I'm in my driveway. And, uh, so the air conditioner brings up and gets noisy. Alright, got my 10. Oh, there we go. When it turns off, then you don't hear it. Very good. Okay. 
and here's my live video and again just to show it I'm going to turn off uh, enabling of this you'll see what it looks like without any stacking with this next update now all I can see are the two stars very good